All right. So what we have discovered is that all materials are either a pure substance or they're a mixture. And the first one we will look at is a pure substance. So a pure substance or a pure material is when all the particles that make up that material are the same. So all the particles in a pure substance are the same. And solids, liquids and gases can be pure. One example of a pure substance that's a solid is gold. So if we zoom in and look at all the particles that make up gold and they're tightly packed together because gold is a solid. If we look at the particles in gold, we can see that they're all gold. They're all the same. So they're all gold particles. Another example would be pure water, which is a liquid. So if we have some pure water in a container, the particles are spread out a little bit further than in the gold. But because it's a pure substance, all those particles are the same. And in this case, they're water particles. They're all water particles. We can also have pure substances that are a gas, something like pure oxygen. Normally we find this in a gas tank, an oxygen tank in places like hospitals. If we look at all the particles that make up pure oxygen, they're spread apart really far because oxygen is a gas, but they're all the same. They're all oxygen particles. All oxygen particles. So now, what's the difference between a pure substance and a mixture? So a mixture is just when we have two or more substances, two or more pure substances that are combined together. Two or more pure substances mixed together. And we can mix together solids, liquids or gases. So solids, liquids or gases can be mixed together to make a mixture. But what are some common mixtures that we might know? The first one you might know is seawater. So if we look at some seawater from the ocean, at the particles in it, there will be a mixture of lots of different types of particles. The main type is water. There are lots of water particles in seawater. But there are also other types of particles mixed in with the water. And the main type that's mixed in in seawater is salt. So there are salt particles moving around mixed together with the water. Another mixture that we might know about uh, is rocks. Because rocks are actually made of different types of minerals mixed together. So 
there will be one type of mineral mixed together with another type of mineral and there might even be a third and a fourth different type of mineral mixed in in a rock but because rocks are solid all these minerals are tightly packed together and we can also have gases that are mixtures as well because air is not just made up of oxygen yes there are some oxygen particles in air and we need that to survive oxygen but there are also lots of nitrogen particles as well in air and air is mostly nitrogen nitrogen and there are some other different types of particles as well such as carbon dioxide which is really important for climate change because it causes global warming in the atmosphere.